Yo guys, welcome back to another video on the channel and today we're going to be taking a look at the best Swiss K31 quick scoping class up in Cold War right now. This gun is absolutely insane. It's a lot of fun to use. I like this sniper a lot and I think it's a great addition into the game. It seems to be a lot better than the last sniper that we got, obviously the ZRG. I feel like this sniper is definitely a lot better and one of the most fun ones to use. But quickly before we do jump into the class up guys and I'm going to show you guys obviously the clips that we did get at the end as well. But quickly before we jump into all of that, if you are new around it, be sure to subscribe to the channel with notifications turned on so don't miss any more videos on the channel. We're already to 10k subs. If you you can help me hit that that'd be absolutely amazing if you do enjoy the video smash thumbs up and let me know your thoughts on this swiss k31 quick scoping class up in the comments below because i'll be interested to see what you guys have to say about it but as i said i'm gonna show you guys the attachments that we run while we run them and then i'm gonna show you guys a bunch of clips of me using this gun at the end of the video so you can check it out for yourself so guys, the first attachment we're actually going to go for is just the standard stabilizer 0.308 on the muzzle. And this is just going to increase the idle sway control, basically meaning when you are ADS, it's just going to be a lot more central. It's not going to sway around as much. And that's pretty much the only reason we go for that. And once you start getting to the GRU suppressor, the task force, the infantry, once you get into all of them, the ADS time drops off dramatically. And obviously the last thing we want to do when we're trying to make a quick scoping class up for this Swiss K31, the last thing you want to do is take away from the ADS time. So we're going to go for the stabilizer 0.308 on this one. Next up, guys, on the barrel, we're going to go for the 24.9 inch tiger team it's going to increase the damage meaning you are going to be able to do more damage obviously when you hit them chest shots it's also going to be a one shot kill headshots always a one shot kill and it's going to be two shots to the body it's going to increase the fire rate another great thing to have mean obviously you can shoot bullets a lot faster so you can pick off kills a lot quicker and every just put nicer clips together really if you can shoot quicker and it's also going to increase the bullet velocity meaning the bullets aren't going to drop off as much so if you are trying to shoot further away and you are trying to get a bit more of a long shot the bullets aren't going to drop off at all and you're going to be deadly accurate with it so next up guys i'm going for the bruiser grip and the reason for this is it increases the movement speed the shooting move speed the, the ads move speed uh just genuinely it increases the speed of the gun a lot which is something that i'd really like to have with my quick scoping class apps it allows you to get in and out of positions better allows you to position yourself nice and well and get in between enemy teams and enemy players and pick off some really nice kills so i like to increase the speed on my guns which is exactly what the bruiser grip does um not much not much in cold war as you guys will know increases the ads speed other than pretty much the grip and one other attachment as well so we're gonna go for the bruiser grip on the under barrel so guys when it comes to the magazine i see a lot of people doing stupid things like chucking on nine rounds ten rounds anything like that I just stick on the first magazine that you can get on any sniper. And in this case, it's going to be the eight rounds. It'll actually only have seven bullets due to the barrel taking away one bullet as well. Because um, that's what the barrel does. However, the reason I don't put anything else on, you can put fast mags on. But the reason I don't put anything other than these two on is once you start getting into the sevens, the tens, the speed loaders, the nines. As you guys can see, again, it takes away from your ADS time. And the last thing you guys want on a quick scoping class out for this Swiss K1, K31 is anything taken away from the ADS time. It's a quick scoping class. You want the best ADS time that you can possibly have and the eight round mags are going to allow you to have that and then finally guys we're going for the airborne elastic wrap pretty much the main reason for this is it is going to increase the ads speed by 12 percent also increases the flinch resistance which is great because if you are being shot at whilst you're ads you can still have that clean shot that clean sight and you'll be bouncing around too much so that's definitely a win you can also drop shot i've never seen that many people drop shot with a sniper so that's not really that's not really relevant here but that ads time is the main reason we are here obviously that plus 12 ads time if you look at some of the others you are going to get a good boost of ads as well however the airborne elastic wrap is going to give you the best ADS ads time possible there's a full overlook at the class app guys i'll quickly scroll through it once more for you guys right here as you guys can see on screen all the attachments are there but but i'm gonna leave it there guys i'm gonna show you guys the clips now that i did manage to get with this class i had a lot of fun running about with this sniper in nuketown and in all the other maps as well i had a lot of fun nuketown especially because it's so close quarters but this gun just absolutely performs on nuketown it's great it's a great quick scoping class i really did have a lot of fun using it and you guys can check out the clips i'm about to show you if you have enjoyed this video please do smash thumbs up as it really does help me out let me know what you want to see in the comments below if there's any more sniper class apps or any other class apps for cold war you do want to see please do let me know in the comments below and i will do my very best to get onto them as soon as possible for you guys i appreciate you watch it all the end if you aren't already subscribed to the channel with notifications turned on make sure you do, do that as it really does help me out we're on the 10k subs so if you can have us hit that that'd be amazing i'm gonna show you guys the clips now as i keep saying but i appreciate you watching all the end. we'll catch you in the next one in a bit one in one house upstairs don't call me don't call me been good fair jack we i got on quite late it's only bad thing but we're, we're here now we're vibing we're, we're grinding on, oh, you doing well, bro? You will have everything maxed, though, won't you? The new sniper, because you don't have to do it for Dark Mask. Straight in the mixer, bro. Please? Oh, well beat up, boys. Oh, he's just running from my man. It's like he's not going to kill me. Bro. 
mate. If that little fucker killed me, I'd have been fuming. You, you'll have everything maxed though, won't you? Huh? You'll have your PVSH maxed by 8 though. Right. No, I don't know, but I want to make a video on it, bro. Oh shit. I wanted to make a video on the fucking sniper as well. Like, they're probably not going to go, you know. 